Hello guys, my name is Esmerant and I'm doing an unboxing and the first impressions of the Samsung S21 Ultra 5G. Um, I had the, um, the note, uh, I've still got my note, um, but I'm doing a trade for that for the Samsung Galaxy S21 Ultra. Um, I heard it was good ratings, I've heard it's, um, you know, the specs on it is out of this world and I thought for myself, uh, pre-order it and uh, give it a go. Um, I do like the Samsung phones that have come out so far over the last three or four years, so it's actually been good, but I've, I'm done with the notes um, because I heard that about the S Pen compatibilities with the Samsung Galaxy um, Ultra, uh, the S21. So, yeah, um, let's, get in, uh, let's get down to it. Also, I just found out as well, when, I, when you do pre-order the phone, you also get the latest galaxy buds pro as well and the latest smart tag um yeah the smart tag by uh, samsung as well so we'll be trying these out um so yeah uh without further ado let's get into the phone hi guys my name's uh, asmarant and this is the, uh, my unboxing of the samsung galaxy s21 ultra 5g and i got it in phantom brown uh the reason it's taking so long it's because of, of the uh, samsung exclusive.com colors um, you can get phantom brown, phantom titanium, I think it's phantom navy um, But I wanted the brown just because it's something different and I've had enough of doing uh, The phantom black and phantom grey or silver or white so I thought I'd go with something different If you pre-order these, uh, pre-ordered the phone like I did You get the Samsung Smart Tab for free And you get the Galaxy Buds Pro uh, For free as well If you didn't and you've just seen this and you've already bought the phone That's £30 I think these are two hundred pounds. Um, so yeah, I was pretty fortunate with that. Uh, this didn't come with it, but I got this on Amazon as a clear case, um, clear phone case because I always get one with the phone that I get. But that's separate. But I'll put the links in the uh, description for you guys. So yeah, uh, let's get opening the phone first. Dun, 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 dun. And this is it. I should see on the bottom. Look at that. That is Phantom Brown. That's not too bad. I like that. It's very nice. I like how big the the grid of glass is as well because it's all protected. And that's the first impression of it. It's nice and big. Um, a lot of people ask why did I swap over from the Note for this one. And the reason being is um, I liked it because of the pen as well. Because I work in hospitality, I always use it for take orders, which is a cheaty idea, but. It saves me paper and it's easy to use on these phones as well so yes I've gone from the phone that I'm using now for the recording being Galaxy Note 20 straight on to the uh, S21 um, so yeah that's the phone that's the Phantom Brown which is not too bad nice cutter and then with it you get pin out to the side so you've got the quick start guide, the warranty card, and you get the USB. It does not come with headphones or the um, the uh, plug socket, the plug, sorry, because they, they've uh, cut that out. I think it's just to save on uh, the ecosystem, uh, well, the ecosystem or anything like that. But I've got the pin as well. So, yeah, um, that's the unboxing for it. It's a quick unboxing. Um, and I'm going to boot it up and I let you see the first impressions of the phone. Alright guys, here we are. Um, all charged, all set up. And uh, and everything. And here we are. Um, what can I tell you about this phone at the moment? Um, it's very good. It's very, very quick. Um, as you can see, very smooth as well. Oh, I've got a software update as well. Didn't know about that. <laughs> um, but yeah, um, if you want to get vivid, like, detailed nice colors out of it um if you go to display um motion smoothness now as you can see uh, adaptive is the fresh rate will go up to 120 hertz that's what you want or to get longer battery life you can have at 60 so i've got mine at 120 because uh, i'm at home um, if i was out i'd probably go back go to 60 um but yeah that's 120 screen mode vivid or you can have it natural uh, I have mine vivid because I like more colours, so uh, I recommend that. And screen mode, no, not screen mode, screen resolution. So 
If you put it on HD, basic visuals, lowest battery use. Full HD, uh, improved visuals, moderate battery use, or the full uh, 320 by 1440, sharpest visuals, most battery use. Um, mine's on that one because I like the I like to watch films or YouTube. So I love to YouTube a lot. Try to get out the highest quality. Um, and on YouTube, it comes out as uh, as it says there, 1440p, 60 frames per second, uh, HDR as well. Um, the sound out of it is uh, brilliant as well. Uh, let me find a sound thing for you. Um, so if I go, actually, I'll use one of my vids. Uh, I'll go that one. Alright guys, welcome back to the next part of Gears of War 2 walkthrough. Um, I feel like we're getting closer and closer near the end, so yeah. Um... So it's pretty loud, I'll, I'll skip on a bit. So it's it's pretty loud. The sound's loud, which is good. You can hear. Um, other than that, it's great so far. Um, tomorrow I will be uh, doing these uh, default videos and pictures for you guys tomorrow. Um, so yeah. Um, other than that, nothing else to say. Um, I love it. I love the brown, the phantom brown. Oh, I just got I've pulled it off. Yep. Phantom Brown, I love the carbon fibre and all that. I love all that, uh, the Gorilla screen, sorry. Um, at the moment, stunning. Uh, very quick, very easy to use. Oh, install. Um, but yeah, other than that, it's really good. I do recommend, quickly though, um, a case. So I got one of these cases. Um, I've got it on Amazon. I think it was a uh, 10.99 or 11.99, but have a look at them, and it's literally straight out the box, just like that. Um, if you're going out, I recommend the uh, half front um, as well, because I'll, um, which I will be having uh, when I go to work and stuff like that, because we're in January lockdown in in the UK. Uh, but other than that. Fantastic phone, and tomorrow I will see you guys then for the pictures and video test. So I will see you then. All right, guys, so I've just done all the video in and the pictures taken. Um, so the video in you'll see in 1080p 60 frames per second, me walking around a the park. Uh, then you'll see the 4K 60 frames per second, and then you'll see um, 8K as well. And then you'll see the different types of photos telephoto, studio photos, selfies, and so forth. And um, yeah, um, let's get into the vid.
So there you go guys, that is my 1080p 60 frames per second, uh, which is like your standard default uh, camera settings. Um, then you've got your 4K 60 frames per second, which is like a bit better, a bit more sharper and colour. And then I didn't do 8K 24 frames per second because when I upload it to computer and try and make it all as one vid, it will take six, seven hours because you need the highest internet megabytes per second as possible. And in my house, I haven't got that. So I'm going to do in 24 hours or 48 hours of this video has been uploaded, I'm going to upload it from my phone. So you will see 8K 24 frames per second from there. So 1080p 60 frames per second, brilliant. 4K 60 frames per second, absolutely great. Then I moved over to the photos, which is a 108 megapixel camera. As you saw, I saw from the zoom 0 0.6, which is like your selfie sort of um, out. And then you've got one, which is like your normal. And then you can zoom in up to 100 times, which you, uh, which you saw there, which is sort of all right if you use it. But I don't think a lot of people will use it. But um, I gave it a go, and it's all right. Plus, also, when you do, I think it's 30, uh, 30 times the zoom, up to 100, you'll have this. Now, this uh, on-screen uh, on screen picture is me uh, taking a picture from that, uh, from that angle. And on the top left-hand corner, you see an in-picture. From 30 frames to 100, you will get that. Because on the uh, in that yellow outline bit, it will tell you where your camera's heading. So if you like you don't know where you are, if you look at that little uh, in picture on the top left hand, it will tell you where your camera's pointing. So you've got a, like a, a steady image, so where you actually want it, which is pretty handy. So that's it, guys. Um, hope you like your unboxing and your first impressions. Um, at the moment, I'm loving this camera. It's fantastic. I'm loving it. Um, in June, maybe, probably May, June, um, I'll give you a, a second update to see how the cam uh, how the camera's going, how the phone going itself uh, is going. Um yeah, just to give me an update if anyone still decides wants to buy this cat uh this phone, sorry. Um yeah, no, no, no that's it. Uh, all finished. I've got the buds for uh, free and the smart tag for free as you saw at the beginning. I will be doing an unboxing video. Um I'll probably do the smart tag first because I'm still using the previous buds on the previous phone I got for free until they run out of battery. Once they do, I'm gonna move on to the next one. Um thanks for guys for watching and I will see you guys on the next video.